Hey everybody, it's Kimberly. I just did a huge haul. Actually, I didn't just do a huge haul. I was out running around doing my last minute Christmas shopping and grocery shopping and stuff like that. So I have a haul to show you. And uh, I have quite a bit of stuff. So the first thing I'm going to show you is something that I like to get every single year. And when I do purchase these, I get a free meal. So I go to Soup Plantation. At some places, it's called Sweet Tomatoes. And if you buy $50 in gift certificates, you get a free meal. So even if you only have like, see for me, I originally only had a $25 gift certificate that I was going to purchase for my mother's husband. And they come in these cute little cards, and then I ended up buying another $25 you know, I'll use it myself or whatever just to get the free meal. I go to Soup Plantation all the time, at least two or three times a month. Um, and they always have really good food. I love their muffins. They've got great soups. So I purchased one of these gift certificates for my father-in-law. And I got my free meal pass. And the other one I think I'm going to give to my son's dad. Um... Typically, for my son's dad, I buy him every year. We're still friends, pretty close, um, platonic, no, you know, funny business there. But I always buy him almond roca. This was three ninety nine at Rite Aid, so I get him, got him this, and he'll be getting this as well. So, also at Rite Aid, I got um, this new Revlon lip butter. In Creamsicle, uh, number 065, um, I watched Lisa Lisa, and she says that she really likes this color. So I thought, well, while I'm out purchasing stuff, I might as well go ahead and give it a shot. I'm not really into lipsticks. I'm more like lip gloss. My lip liner is tattooed, although I do, it's very lightly tattooed, so I do... Um, occasionally wear lip liner and such different lipsticks. I'm just kind of starting to get into the lipsticks. I think uh, for those of you who have been watching me since the beginning, which hasn't been very long, you know that I just started getting into makeup um, at 40. So anyway, she said she likes this, so I'm going to try it on for you guys right here. Yeah, because actually it's a very nice nude color. Oh, it's pretty. Definitely something I'm going to wear often. So, anyway, another thing that I bought, um, I went to Target. And what I bought there was this scarf. This is, uh, it was 20% off, so $12. It was regularly $14.99. Um, so, I do have a ton of scarves. But it's a really beautiful metallic gold color, very shimmery, very holiday-ish. I got it for myself for Christmas. So I like the one girl, uh, so-and-so's lookbook, how she does the 25 ways to wear a scarf. So I have a ton of scarves. I'm eventually going to show you guys, give you guys a tour of my closet just to show you how many scarves I have. I collect them. I've got one from Amsterdam and all, all over the place. So anyway, I got this. Um, I went to Macy's and I got a few items there. I actually cashed in on a free sample Estee Lauder Resilience Lift. Look how cute this little bottle, bottle is. So it's supposed to give you a lift. I put it underneath my eyes last night before bed. Can you tell a difference? <laughs> so I got that. Um, I purchased for myself my favorite perfume, which is Burberry Classic. They had a $40 um, gift box, and inside it has five of their most popular scents. And what I like about it, I probably should have just went and splurged a little bit more and got what um, I always get, my favorite. So this is how, what the bottles look like. There's five teeny tiny little samples, basically, oops, of the Burberry brand. But look how cute these tiny little bottles. This is my favorite favorite. So it's the classic Burberry. 
Here's another little bottle. They're just so little. Look how tiny, tiny, tiny they are. Um, but that's what I bought for myself for Christmas. You know, I always buy myself stuff because I work really, really hard. I've been raising three children since I was 20. Well, I didn't raise three since I was 20, but I've started having children at 20. Here's another one. Look at just how cute these little bottles. They're just, I mean, so cute. So, I don't regret buying it. I'll try them all out. I actually decided to put this one on today. So, I got that at Macy's. Another thing I got at Macy's for several people um, on my Christmas list are these Elizabeth Arden Quad uh, Lip Gloss with Bag. These are just little gifts. Um, one of them is for my son's teacher. Uh, this one is for a girlfriend of mine. I mean, you can't go wrong. There's four really pretty colors uh, in here. It, this you could put your cell phone in. If you smoke, you could put a pack of cigarettes in, which I don't condone smoking. And inside, there's four colors. There is golden red. Let's see if you can see. There is... Rosebud. There is sheer something. Sheer starlight. Another color. These are all very shimmery. Looks like this one is matte, possibly. And then the last one is peony which I love this although I don't care for the glittery but I do love the peony color this is one of my favorites in Bobbi Brown they had one so um and these were 1950 so I got I actually ended up getting three of these gift packs um for three different people on my on my list so these I thought were just a great deal right now at Macy's they have a lot of awesome awesome gift deals so these at Macy's um, let's see what else do I have to show you guys I went to Sally's oh I actually went to my beauty supply store and I got a gel OPI gel nail color and I got an OPI nail envy because I actually just took my acrylics off I hadn't had them on for very long but I just decided I don't really want acrylics. I don't want to have to go and get them done. It's just time consuming and it takes up money. And I really just, I, you know, I have to have them so short because I am a massage therapist. So anyway, this is a natural nail strengthener. It's called Nail MV for sensitive peeling nails. So I got that. Um, I don't have my receipt on me. And then I got the OPI. I think together they were like $23. So the OPI was probably $4.50. And this was probably, who knows what, $12. Um, and so at Sally's, I ended up purchasing my own uh, UV lamp that was on sale for $60. And so it is a 36 watt. It is perfect for curing all brands of UV gels, soak up gels, and UV top coats. So here you go, $60 at Sally's. Um, I am a professional, so... Um, I got it at a professional discount, but you guys, um, it's open to the public, so you guys can go too, and then I ended up getting a mini top coat for that, um, and then I also got the Orly Gel and Glitter Nail Lacquer Pocket Removers, so you just stick these on your nails with the little remover stuff. And what else did I get? I really have a lot of stuff here. I went to the 99 cent store, which I absolutely love to do. And um, I built, I'm, I've, I'm going to build my in-laws a gift basket. I don't usually buy them a lot, but I just like to thank them because they're really good to my son. So I got two packages of gift tissue. One of them is Darling. It's just plain white with little different colored glitters. Um, and there's 20 pieces. So this is good year-round for just any kind of gift. And then I got one Christmas one with four different um, types of tissue all Christmas I love 
basically I've stopped wrapping gifts and I just put them in a bag and I don't you know I don't even have any special bags sometimes I you know do collect bags along the way for Christmas but I can just put it in a Macy's bag or a, just any kind of a you know a bag that I have a shopping bag not like some nasty plastic one but I'll just top it with some really pretty paper and it's just as good um, and then at the 99 cent store I got some bows that's a great deal um, I actually got this at Target for a dollar. It is gift wrap. Um, it's good to have some around. You never know when you might need it. Um, for my neighbor who helped me, I was selling my motorcycle and he had helped me get it started and got, you know, he spent some time helping me while he was on his way to work. He saw me in the garage and came over and helped me. I mean, I looked a wreck. I hadn't brushed my teeth. My hair was all up in a bun. I just looked terrible. So I got him a six pack of beer. He's a really nice neighbor of mine. He's actually quite handsome too. So I'm going to take that six pack of beer, put it on his patio with a little card. I'll probably put these little bells and such around it. Um, a dollar at the dollar store. And then I got two packages of these Werther's original um, for something. I'm not sure what. I got two ribbons for a dollar. Not two, but each of them were a dollar. Um, so for my in-laws, I intend to um, do a basket for them. Uh, I got some for one dollar. This is a good deal. Ten quart freezer bags. Um, for a dollar, I also got these glass stars. I have heart ones on my vanity, but these are going to be good for candies. Probably those are Werther's Originals. So I got two of those. It's a really good price. You know, a dollar for these. Just super, super cute. So in this basket is a dollar. Probably highly overpriced for this basket. But what I'm going to do in this basket, it's going to be for my in-laws. I'm going to take these two little coffee cups stick it in there and I'm going to put some uh, hot chocolate, all of the stuff I got from the dollar store, hot chocolate, some crumpets or cookies, you know, butter cookies I think these are, shortbread cookies, and then they have a little dog and uh, named Molly, so I got Molly this and I got her some snacks, so that's going to go in the basket and I'm going to take the ribbon that I bought and some tissue paper and this is going to be their gift basket for Christmas. It was a very inexpensive way to um, shop and it's not that I'm cheap but you know they have everything. They're older. They don't need anything so I would like to get them something they can consume and I know that they will absolutely love that I thought about them and got all that stuff. So something else I got at the dollar store are these glasses. I got some champagne glasses and I got some really nice wine glasses as well. So each of them were a dollar. I actually had purchased them earlier in the month and broke them. So being a dollar, I wasn't heartbroken. So another thing I got at the dollar store were these baskets. I am a volunteer at a pet rescue and inside the cupboard where they have all of their you know supplies it's a total mess and I'm a complete neat freak so I go to the dollar store and I buy these baskets to organize you know to help keep everything organized so let's see what else did I get you guys do I have anything else to show you no oh I do I have one more thing I actually went grocery shopping and I won't bore you with all my grocery um, items, but I did want to show you something that I thought was really, really cute. It was for two dollars and I don't, I don't know, twenty-seven cents, two dollars and fifty cents, something like that. It's a little box of tomatoes, and the reason why I bought it was it came with this little tomato um, keeper. So, like, I like to eat tomatoes all the time, so you can just open this and put them in here close it and stick it in your lunch box and you have tomatoes to go. I don't have one of these. It was attached to this little box which I think is super super cute. Um, and normally the cherry tomatoes where I live are 
anywhere from $2.99 all the way up to $4.99. So for $2.50 roughly, I get this plus this. That's why I bought it at my local health food store called Sprouts. So if any of you guys live in, the, in my area, they have them at Sprouts. So anyway, I guess that's about it. I can't think of anything else here that I got. Um, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this Christmas holiday haul, and I hope you all have a fabulous holiday. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Mwah. Bye.